It's Reveille. This isn't just a wake-up call. It's a full-throttle alert to all parents in Illinois. There is a massive attack on our school children by the teacher unions in this state. Legislation filed on behalf of the Illinois Education Association, if enacted, could shut down schools by giving the Department of Health complete control over how both public and private schools provide in-person instruction, or if they provide it at all when the governor declares a health emergency. Let's be clear, this bill is not about safety, it's about power and control. Much to the embarrassment of the teacher unions, private schools and a few rogue public schools have safely kept the doors open and the classrooms full since last August. Faced with remote learning, parents have moved their children out of public schools to private school to get in-person instruction. Some have left the state entirely for sports and learning, and many other parents have pressured school boards to fully reopen. School leaders aren't following the science, and their incompetence is obvious after months of data. But in one-size-fits-all policy, no one gets embarrassed, so they file a bill like this. In the future, bureaucrats would rather have other bureaucrats make decisions on your children than take the heat themselves for mistakes made. In a further assault on our children, the unions also support bills that ask for waivers from testing. They know that remote learning was a disaster, and they are hoping you won't figure that out. This is a wake-up call to parents in Illinois. The bill, HB 2789, already passed the Illinois House with only Democrat votes. It is now in the Senate. You can help stop the bill by calling and asking your state senator to oppose this legislation. I'm Jeannie Ives, co-founder of Breakthrough Ideas. Get more details by going to breakthrough-ideas.com.